welcome back to the Divine Outdoors. Today we're going to uh, a little walk up the Priscelli Hills. Um, don't actually have a plan of where I'm going, I'm just going to walk. Uh, kids are in school, which is handy. Um, yeah, it's quite windy up here, so I don't know how good the sound's going to be. But uh, yeah, just me and the dog. For some unknown reason, I decided to follow the dog across all of that. Um, yeah, boggy, to say the least. But um, seems to be back on a normal path now. So that up there, over that brow is uh, Foylecombe Kerwin, uh, highest point in Pembrokeshire, five hundred and. 36 meters I believe um, might venture over that on the way back at the minute we're gonna head east so the route we're walking today is part of the Golden Road uh, which starts in the car park that we've just parked in uh, it's about a six and a half mile hike across the Priscelli's uh, ends in Crimach uh, further in the east. Uh, Priscelli blue stones, right round here supposedly. But uh, yeah, the same stones that they made, or supposedly, read into it what you can, that uh, stones used at Hen Stonehenge are from this area. Don't know how they got them there. They wouldn't have been putting them on the back of a lorry, I can assure you of that. So yeah, so we're just heading up towards Foil Feather Eye. Uh, 467 meters. Doesn't sound a lot, uh, given like Brecon Beacon, Snowdonia, Black Mountains, uh, that sort of that sort of range. These aren't really big peaks or summits, but um, yeah, they're just. They're just nice to get to. As you hear me splashing through the water there. Yeah, the dog thinks he's a kangaroo for some reason. Absolutely leaping over everything. He's got one hell of a jump on him though. This little dog. Much of this you'll be able to hear, but um, yeah, cracking day. Visibility is not as good as you'd expect or want. Just up here, Foyle come Kelwin, highest point in Pembrokeshire. Move along the ridge line. Our car, or my car, not our, is parked over here. Uh, that peak there, cut foil area, uh, an easy, it's only a mile up and down. Uh, as you move along again, Carningley, move around Newport Sands. If ever you've been to Pembrokeshire and you haven't been on that beach, wake up. So just leaving foil feather eye there. Just making my way towards Minith Bach. I <laughs> just got a sight of some stones over there. Um, Looks like something out of bloody Game of Thrones. One thing I would say about walking up to Priscelli's, because you don't do it in the rain, it's horrible, but don't think you'll wait for a couple of dry days before you can go up. It's always wet up here. It's, uh, it's, just, it's just 
that's what it is. Love coffee. Uh, out here on my own. Who? Hello. How are you? Do you want to be my friend? <laughs> Lonely world. Dachavi. <laughs> Don't follow a dog. He ain't got a clue. Uh, there we go, 3.6 miles in, uh, made it to Carnbeaker, uh, just about. Um, now heading back over to the car, the same way we came, hopefully avoiding the bogs. Yeah, it started to drizzle, uh, wind's picking up a little bit. So yeah, it's glorious over there though, I'll show you. Why can't I have you walking over there? Do you ever get that feeling when you've walked somewhere and you're walking back the same route? And you think to yourself, I didn't walk downhill this much. It's a hell of a climb back up. I must have come down here, because I'm going back the same way. With Can Ingley over there, absolutely just nearly fell over. <laughs> Well, the dog's just come running back from a bush over there. Um, nose pouring with blood. You know, a big slice in his nose. So he's had to stop and uh, calm that down. Yeah, nasty little gash on his nose. Don't know what it was from. Didn't yelp or anything, so... No one knows. Well, that's us nearly back at the car. I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. Um, yeah. Feel free to drop any comments in the box below. Um, I try and answer everything. Uh, if you want to know any more about the walk, equipment, um, coffee, if you want to know anything about coffee. And uh, yeah, hit that subscribe button, ding the little bell notification, and uh, give me a thumbs up. Cheers, thanks for now, and goodbye. Dios.